number and we welcome back to the desk a very familiar face to people who watch this show for some time. Brandy Braun is here. How yes, are you, buddy? I am doing very well. How are you doing? Good. You are involved in something going on. It starts tomorrow. I want to let people know about it. You've talked about this for a long time. Yes. So now it's time to make sure everybody knows about it. It is. So we are flying in the Wounded Warrior Amputee Softball Team. So all across the country, these guys are coming in. Some have lost arms. Some have lost full legs. Um, and they, some of them just play with prosthetics. One guy just hits with his one arm. Um, so they're going to come in and take on Des Moines able-bodied athletes. How about that? Much. Yeah. Now this is more than just a single event. Yes. Okay, this goes on all weekend. Yes. So we are going to have weekend-long events. Starts Friday um, about 7 o'clock. You can meet and greet, hear all of their stories, come in, talk to some of the guys. Um, there is one gal as well. And then, um, yeah, <laughs> and then, yeah, exactly. Saturday we're going to be playing softball all day long. Um, it's kind of a pool play tournament and one of the Wounded Warriors will play on the team. Um, they'll play all day. Seven o'clock is when they take on local veterans. So um, come out for that. That's going to be service guys past and present here in the Des Moines area. Mm -hmm. um, so that's going to be really cool. And then Sunday we're going to be at Principal Park, which is going to be awesome. And they're going to take on some past celebrities and media people. Well, how so, about that? Yeah. Yeah, now, nice what time video. do all these different things, we saw the times for the, the games on Saturday, but what about Sunday? What time do the games start yep. on Sunday? Sunday, it's at 10 o'clock is going to be when the Wounded Warriors play. If you come out a little bit before, bring out the family kids. We've got the Miracle League playing, so the kids are going to be on the field hitting oh, T-balls, oh, really? shagging balls. So, yeah, it's going to be really cool. So it'll be a fun family event. Um, then we also have the local um, Des Moines police taking on firefighters after that so it's kind of I'm with cover my six and then we're also donating some proceeds to the homeless shelter for their veteran programs okay so we pretty much for the last three years we've been donated to wounded warrior and um, paid to fly them in so that we could raise money for our local community. That is great. Yeah. So, so. Is, is it going real well? You do it, ha, you having fun doing it? Yes. Oh my gosh. It's absolutely fabulous. I'm really excited to meet all the guys there. A few of them are going to be in tomorrow. Um, we're taking them to Jethro's. They're our presenting sponsors. So we're going to go fill them up with a bunch of wings and mac and cheese. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and then, yeah, it's it's absolutely, we're going to have about 200 guys playing wow. softball. So, wow. you know, 16 to 18 teams going on. We're going to have some music going on down at the field, silent auction, raffle tickets. I mean, it's free. All ages. That was all my next question. Long. What does it cost to get in? Nothing. All weekend long. Uh, you know, we gladly accept donations, of course, but other than that, nothing. Just more of an awareness and, and celebrating the accomplishments. Of Absolutely. All these and really showing them an Iowa welcome. I mean, they fought for our country, lost a limb, gave oh, up time geez. with their family, and yeah. it's just important that people are aware of what they go through. Now, in case people want to come out on Sunday, you mentioned uh, some local celebrities here, and yes. one of them, very prominent, Iowa Hawkeye. Yeah. Yes, NFL, yes, Timmy Dwight. And Timmy then, Dwight is playing exactly. The game. Mm -hmm. um, and then we've got some past basketball players. Um, we have some media people coming out. It's good. It's just going to be a blast. So okay. my name's still on the list. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, I got you out there. Okay. Do you have your glove ready? You I better find it. Yeah, you better. <laughs> Where's that thing? Yeah, you might want to oil it, run it over with your car. Do I need cleats or spikes uh, or anything? You know, you wear whatever you want. I'm pretty sure you're all going to get your butt swept anyway. Ah, <laughs> I agree completely. I mean, maybe not, but I don't think baseball, softball has really been most of these guys' forte. No, not at no. all. No. Yeah, not at <laughs> so all. So I'm intrigued. Okay. I'm very intrigued. I want a home run out of you. It's Principal Park. It's not that hard. No, a home run is when you get it to the pitcher's mound, right? Yeah. Okay. Is that what it is? That's what yep. it is. Okay. Okay. okay, it's double checking. It we'll get for a while. <laughs> live feed of you running to first, too. That's <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's go over all it, the yeah. different things all again. All the details. Yes, okay. okay, so Friday. Starts tomorrow. Yes, Walker Johnson, 7 o'clock meet and greet home run derby skills session. Nice. That's going to be cool. Absolutely, it's going to be phenomenal. Um, Saturday, all day long, the actual softball games are going to start around like 8.30ish, and those are going to just be your regular average Des Moines people playing softball. Each team has now, a wounded warrior. Walker as well? Walker okay. Johnson as well. All day long, 7 o'clock p.m. That night, the Wounded Warriors will play local veterans from Des Moines area. That's going to be awesome. Yes, okay. fabulous. So then Sunday morning, 8.30ish, uh, Miracle League, and bring out your kids, and we're going to just let them get down on Principal Park and enjoy enjoy the beautiful morning. That is so morning. neat you're doing that. Yeah. I know you're doing it there. Yeah. I thought maybe it was originally at the at the park across the street, but you're doing it on the yeah, field. Yeah, we're doing it on the field so that they can you oh know, my see all of the big eyes are oh, be this they big. are. Yeah. And I, think, I mean, they're going to meet the players, so it's going to be very inspiring, I think, to them. Just show them, you know, 
know, there are challenges you can overcome. And then the games thing. begin about what, 10, 12 10, o'clock? About 10, 10.30, we'll have a national anthem, we'll introduce uh, the Wounded Warriors, and then they'll start playing um, all of you guys, and then after that we'll do our police versus firefighter, and then our championship of the tournament um, goes after that. So. Now there's a lot of details there. Is there a place yes. you can go to just kind of follow up on what's going on? Absolutely. So we have Cover My Six Foundation on Facebook. Or they can go to www.covermysixfoundation.com. Okay, so, perfect. Yeah, and uh, we are still looking for a few volunteers, so people can get a hold of me, and Brandy. So okay. just find me. Okay. <laughs> yeah. and, and what's the easiest way for you? So you can just hop on Facebook and say you want to volunteer to our Cover My Six Foundation page. Okay. Um, just say you heard it on KCWI, and okay. I'd gladly hook you up with a shift. There you go. Perfect. And once again, all the events that Brandy just mentioned, free. 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 All ages, free. This Fabulous is be fun. Time. That is great. Yeah.